Hey guys. <laughs> it's been a while. That's loud. Damn. Don't don't speak directly into the microphone. That's a bad idea. That's what a bad idea is. Hey guys. <laughs> it's me. You know, uh, your friendly neighborhood mess who's been kind of gone for a while. This is an update video. Let's talk about things. First off, I bet a lot of you have been wondering, where have I been? Except I've been releasing like a few free verses. One that was on like TikTok, another one that I did a while ago for a Porter Robinson song beat thing. And then recently a new one that I just recorded this. Last December, I had hair in my mouth. But other than that, I've been kind of MIA, to be honest. I've had a pretty bad 2010 and 2021, but 2022 is looking like it's going to be a lot better. Here's to hoping. That's where I've been, at least. I've been depressed and dealing with life, so I haven't had very much creativity. I've just been stuck here at home, being sad and, yeah, wasting life, I guess. <laughs> So, with that said, what can you expect going forward? That's the next, uh, that's the next point on my, you can't see that, but it's the next point on my list. A couple of exciting things are happening right now, slowly, but they are happening. I can tell you that, um, three new people have joined Canvas Records. That's actually the next point, so I skipped one. Well, it kind of ties together, so <laughs> obviously you can expect new music. We have a lot of things planned. I won't spoil too much, but one of the new people who joined and I have been working on an album for the better half of a year. More than a year. I don't know why I said the better half. More than a year we've been working on this album. I'm really excited. I feel like it's, it's turning out amazing and we're strongly hoping to release it this year. Possibly you could hear a single from the album soonish let's not make any promises but um we're hoping we're hopeful yeah a new 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 people joined the cameras records and i think that they might have filmed a little introduction video so let's hand it over to um, the new recruits and uh, let's see how they want to introduce themselves to you guys take it away hello my name is johanna I am a singer and a songwriter from Denmark and I have joined Canvas Records in the hopes of sharing my music with the world. I sing in both English and Danish, so sometimes maybe not everybody is gonna understand what is being said in the song, but I hope that the music will transcend languages and help you understand the emotions behind it. <laughs> Or else I'll put up a translation. I'm looking forward to starting actually recording and publishing my music in a record label. And I hope you'll join me. What's up everybody? My name is Enerus. I'm a rapper from Chicago. I'm very pleased to announce that we will be working on Canvas Records for the foreseeable future. Maz has been a friend for some time now. This just seemed like a logical progression. I'm hoping that with a little bit of your help, we can do some big shit in the future. As for who I am, we'll know soon enough. What's up everyone? This is Kate Drace, also known as K Dragon, and I am one of the new members of Canvas Records and I'm very excited to be joining the crew. And though I am new to Canvas Records, I am not new to mess. We actually just had our nine year friend anniversary. I've been fucking with this guy since 2013 and I've loved every minute. Our friendship actually blossomed from him reaching out to me on ye old Tumblr and he asked me to sing on one of his rap songs so I definitely think that is full circle a lot of character development coming back around and now I'm the rapper and he's the producer and I love that for us and I can't wait to see what we do together and I know I just got here but let me tell you what I already dropped a single on you guys it's been out since Friday and you've been missing out honestly if you hadn't heard it it's called the stars can't have you and we actually whipped this one out back in 2018 but never released it it was going to be part of a bigger album but the album just never came to fruition so 
so now it's an EP and you guys got a single. It all worked out for everyone. So definitely go hit that up. It's a bop streaming on Spotify now. I want to thank you all for having me. I'm very excited to be here and I can't wait to see what we all do together. Mass is a cunt. I have no idea what they just said, by the way, because I'm filming this before they filmed their intro videos, so... All of them could basically call me a fucking cunt and I wouldn't have any fucking idea. Mass is a cunt. Isn't that fun? Now, one of the big points on my list. Are there gonna be more Incredibox music? Because I know that most of the subscribers on this channel come from Incredibox remixes. I'm not gonna say necessarily that there won't be any more Incredibox music, but it's, it's definitely not my priority. I've liked making them, I've enjoyed remixing the, the sounds and everything, but honestly I just I really want to work on my own music and, and with these new people, help them create their music. That's that's the whole point of, of them joining Cameras Records. I wanna expand, I wanna I wanna be more of a producer than necessarily an artist myself. I'm still gonna release music under my own uh, name. I actually have an album planned that isn't gonna be under mess, which uh, which uh, which isn't exciting. I don't know if you can figure out what uh what alias it's gonna be under, but um she has released an album before. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah. To wrap that up, Incredibox music? Maybe, maybe not. Let's see what happens. If, if a new version gets released, I'm probably gonna check it out and just see how I feel, but I won't promise anything. So I hope that you guys are willing to stay and listen to the other music that we're gonna release. Cause I feel like if you like my Incredibox remixes, you're likely gonna enjoy most of the music that I'm putting out. Cause the thing about the Incredibox remixes is that I definitely put my own spin to it. I know that I, I mostly just chopped the, the samples from the, the games and like, I didn't, I didn't really compose anything myself, but I feel like I made them unique and, and the structure and everything has the mess flavor. <laughs> You know, I hope you're gonna stick around and, and give the other stuff a chance. That's all I have to say about the Incredibox situation. My next point is actually upcoming projects, with, which I already have talked a bit about. Another thing that is coming very soon, last Friday, from when this video goes up, obviously, you might have seen a new artist appear on here, which she's already introduced herself. Kate Dragon, um, my friend Kate. But yeah, you, you would have heard a, a single from her, which I produced, uh, of course, <laughs> of course, called The Stars Can't Have You. And that is actually the first single from an upcoming EP that will hopefully be out next Friday. That's the plan at least. So so let's, let's hope that everything goes as planned. It's not a new EP, it's actually from 2018. We finished it back then basically and just never really released it because I think we had bigger plans. We wanted to make more songs than the four tracks that are on the EP right now, but it was basically done. So we were like, okay, why not just put this out and then label it as from 2018. So people know that it's not, it's not perfect in my eyes, but I really liked the EP. It turned out better than I remembered. I'm really excited about releasing that. Just again, to wrap things up about the upcoming projects, me and uh, Inneris got an album coming hopefully this year. Things move at the pace they do and there's life situations and COVID is still around. There's a lot of things that could slow down the progress, but the plan is to release it this year. Joanna and I have, haven't have really gotten started yet, but she has a lot of songs written and composed and everything. We just need to turn them into full songs and see where that goes. Who knows, maybe it'll become an EP or an album or something, or maybe it'll just be a bunch of singles. I don't know, it's up to her, is the thing. I'm not making the choices for these guys and gals. I'm just the guy who has the channel and the opportunity to share these people's music. So I'm, I'm really excited about that. As far as other projects go, I have some ideas and concepts for my The Messy channel. I might rename that actually, I'm not sure, but we'll see. It's basically my own personal YouTube channel that isn't music based. I, I sometimes do music related things on there, but it isn't just like a music channel where I post my music, you know. One of the videos I have planned for that channel is actually my favorite albums of all time. I started writing the list for that and it turned out to be way longer than I expected. Currently I have like 30 favorite albums and almost like 40 
honorable mentions. That word is so hard to say. Honorable, honorable mentions, whatever. So yeah, the list is long, basically, is what I'm saying. I really want to make the, the video for that kind of more cinematic and, and go really in depth with it. So let's see how, if that comes out. Other than that, I'm also working on video games with Kate, mostly visual novels, because that's the thing that I'm most comfortable coding at the moment. Me and her started a game studio together called Drowsy Dragon, and I'll leave links to everything related in the, in the description. We haven't really finished anything yet but uh we've been working on games for the past year maybe two uh, my memory isn't very good when it the, for these past years because everything's been a fucking mess yeah but um games could be coming check out the drowsy dragons to keep updated on that let's see oh yeah i do want to mention that i actually have a patreon i started it last year but i don't think i really mentioned it anywhere so if you do want to support me it would help a lot i'm not struggling necessarily financially i'm not i'm not doing good either yeah if you want to support me you don't have to obviously uh, i'm still gonna release everything on the channel and on spotify and stuff so you're still gonna get it but there is some uh, good stuff that you can get if you support me on patreon i haven't uh, really been active on there yet and i probably should do stuff before people join so there is actually content for people to enjoy but it's been hard to actually want to post and share things on there when nobody is supporting me so it feels like if i did that i would just waste more time posting for nobody i think i really want to kick it up when the first person joins my patreon to support me because that way i know that there's someone who sees what i'm gonna do and i know it's not very like appetizing to subscribe to someone or support someone financially who isn't posting anything yet but i promise that when someone is there even if it's just one person i'm gonna do my best to keep that updated and share stuff like behind the scenes and all that stuff so that's that but again you don't have to support me on there it's not obligated at all i'm still gonna release everything for everybody and yeah that's uh that's basically it at the end here i just want to say thank you so much from the bottom of my heart to all the people who have subscribed all the people who like my music all the people who comment and every i read all the comments honestly i sometimes read them more than once if you want to leave a comment please do even if it's negative i don't i don't really care to be honest the negative negativity doesn't hit me so if you want to post something that is negative or critical feedback or whatever i'm open to it i love reading comments even if they're not always positive the positive ones are obviously more enjoyable to read but yeah please comment more <laughs> i hope you stay tuned i hope you i hope you enjoy what is coming because i'm really proud of what we've been making um here at canvas records and i can't wait to share it with you so thank you very much and stay tuned Good things are gonna happen.